So, hey everybody, remember I was telling you guys that I was going to start beekeeping. Um, because now I have a place to put the bees. So, I got the box today and I'm going to try to do a little unboxing video. And this is where I got the two packages. Now, honestly, one package was ripped on the end. So, I'm hoping everything's in there. And today, I think I'm going to go ahead and put, try to put this one together and we'll see how it goes. Okay, so I'm guessing these are the hive thingies, uh, where the bees do their honey stuff. Hold on, let me go get the tripod. Okay, so I got the box open, and these are the frames. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven frames. I'm going to take one out, see what it looks like. Oh, pretty. Pretty. It looks really nice. And I guess this is a little flow tube that goes on there somewhere at some point. So I'm just going to leave this in here. And this is the part of the bag that was ripped. It's this, the little twisty thing. I don't think there's anything else in there. I see something in there. Okay, so they're, oh, the little high frame. I don't know. I don't know what they are, but I'm going to go ahead and, them. and we'll see. I'm very new to this, so I don't know all the parts to it. So, what to call them correctly. So, I guess these are, oh, the little things that, I think these are like extra. So, okay. Cool. And there's a book in there. Yay! Flow instruction manual. So, I guess I got to read this to figure out how to put it all together. And I'm going to actually just leave this. I'm going to scoot that out of the way. And open up the other box. see what we got oh okay here's the actual actual instruction instruction so what i will do i'm going to read through this and i will as i put it together i'll videotape bits and pieces of it but i need to concentrate and focus right now so let me do that and i'll be right back Okay, well, I think what I will do, not gonna talk too much. I might just have to like overdo this video. So, I think I'm gonna take out all the different parts and look at them and label them. Not label them, but a lot of parts in here. Woo, pretty. And set that there. I kind of like putting stuff together and I kind of don't, but we're going to give it our best shot. So taking everything out, what is this? It's all wrapped very nicely. Okay. Those are things. Set that aside. There's a, one of the tops, I believe. Set that aside. Ooh, lots of pieces. So, more pieces. So, I'm going to set everything aside. Sorry, I'm not the one to tell you what all these pieces are. Um, you have to get one for yourself. <laughs> Take it from there. What is this? Ooh, okay. Stuff. Let me set that over here. 
more paper. Pretty. And, oh. All right, now, if you get one of these, keep in mind, there are a lot of pieces to it. Oh, I get, oh, this is a hat and veil. Don't know what that is. Didn't know I got the hat with it. The beekeeper veil. So, more pieces. More pieces. It's so pretty. They use a really good quality wood. I hate to paint it. I know they say paint it, but we'll see. Okay, what is this? We'll find out. More little pieces. I have put so many things together. Sometimes I'm a fan, sometimes I'm not. I like the paper. That and okay, so these pieces that are in here, I'm gonna stack them up a little bit. And okay, all right, it looks a hot mess, but let me go read the instruction manual and I will be. Okay, well, we made it outside and I'm getting ready to paint the Flow Hive number one. So, all the it says all the exterior needs to be painted with um, exterior wood paint, which is fine. And I'm going to hope I don't make a mess on all my little knobs, but we'll see how it goes. It is so adorable. I just love it. I'm going to hope that it all works out. Oops, there's me, my shadow. And cute. Okay, so I'm getting ready to paint the flow hive I'm just gonna do like two coats of white and then we'll decorate it with some other colors later the only thing is I love it this color but I guess I sort of kind of get the whole point why it's got to be painted so it'll be weatherproof so wish me luck Okay, as you can see, it came out pretty cute. Um, I probably need to add a little more decoration to the left and the right side. And I didn't put any paint on the back, but I'm going to work on all of that today. So, so far it came out kind of cute. I kind of wish it stayed the other. I left it plain with the wood and just stained it, but... This will be fine. It looks really nice. Okay, so I got all the bees in the flow hive. I don't have my veil on right now, so I'm not going to get too close. But we'll see where it goes. Not sure why they're all hanging out on the side, but hey, I don't have my bail on, so I gotta go.